Hello, Veteran 021 here. Welcome back, and we are let's play Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. In the last episode, we acquired the Grunt Armors. And, uh, now hopefully these guys are gonna let us in. <laughs> Tried what? Black truffles. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I'll ever, ever try a chocolate truffle again after seeing American Wedding. Yeah, pretty nasty. It could be dog shit. Why can't we just walk past them? Attack first? Wow, so even these disguises can't just let us get through here? That doesn't make any sense. So yeah, I remember the first time I played this game, this part was kind of a bitch. Yeah, alright, yeah, we were supposed to use the map. Yeah, use the rotating or R stick. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Shut up. Uh-oh. Oh, what, it didn't work? Oh, crap. Well, I guess it didn't work. So, let's go back. Yeah, we failed. It's gonna happen from time to time. Yeah, it's kind of a bitch getting through here, I'm not gonna lie. First time I played, I had quite a lot of problems trying to get through here. So I'll try to try to do the best I can this time without screwing up too much, hopefully. So yeah, we get past him, then we're gonna want to come over here. And, uh, what are we doing now? I forgot what we're supposed to do at this point. Oh. Stay away from him, I think. Oh. Alright, that helps. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bad, bad idea. Is he gonna be able to see me? Oh, of course. Oops! I, I just don't get the pattern of these guards, man. Oh. Damn it. Alright, let's try it again. I still don't understand why the hell we gotta sneak past these idiots. I mean, we're dressed as freaking pig guards, right? You'd think that'd be enough.
Where's that other one going? Okay. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here, but I'm guessing I gotta wait for that other guard to stop moving once he gets to the corner over here, right? Please tell me he stops there and turns around, right? Okay, perfect. Thank you. Whew. Made it. What the hell? What are we in some kind of boiler room or something? Yes. Let's go through the manhole. Yes, Trippy. Fine, Trippy. Keep your disguise on. <laughs> it's not much of a disguise, but whatever. Yeah, that, that's a good that's a good strategy. Uh, considering that the freaking guards are too dumb to come up and pick up the freaking hat that they see randomly, you know, on the floor as they walk by. On some kind of it's court amazing. yard. Yeah, it sure is something. Or so lobby this is area. how the other half live, is it? Proper swanky, this is. Oi, hmm? it's this way. Come on, get a move on. Okay, are you sure about this? Ah! Huh? Uh, what? Ah! what no! Oh, crap. Porso Grozo. <laughs> okay, it's boss time. Power toppler, huh? Interesting. Uh, let's go with the little thunderbolts. Ooh, look at that. Gotta love it. Physical attacks don't work very well. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I, we, we know this, Trippy. I already know this. Thank you for enlightening me. Yes, now's our chance to throw lightning bolts up his ass.
Ooh, ooh, ooh. You know what? Um. Yeah, I want Monkey to get this. Primal Roar. Here we go. Oh, that didn't do much at all. Firewall. Bam. Look at that. Here goes nothing. Mm. Uh oh. Well, oh, that's it. <laughs> Yay. Yeah. No problem if you're overpowered. Hog's Cog. <laughs> Take the damn thing off. Let's go this way, eh? like a girl to me. Someone's coming. Must hurry. <gasps> Who are you? <gasps> Could you must be? You're the prince. C correct. I am Prince Marcusan, ruler of Hanlin. And who might you be? Oh, you see, um... What do you think you're doing here? Huh? Oh, oh, no! Oh, get away! Do not look at me! Get out of here, I say! You mustn't look at me! Go! Be gone! Wow. This guy's got issues. Wow. So the prince is the great sage. Got it in one. Just who in the world are you? Your Highness, you have nothing to fear. There's something we'd like to ask you. Something to ask me? Ah, oh, I see. Now you know my secret. You mean to blackmail me. That's not it. We came to... We wanted... We need the Great Sage's help. Huh? Great Sage? You mean me? Yes, of course we do. You were one of the Great Sages who protected this world, weren't you? I am sorry to disappoint you. It was my father who was the Great Sage. He passed away 15 years ago. But you inherited his powers, didn't you? The Great Sage's powers? <laughs> you should not believe everything you hear. I was never good enough. How could I be a Great Sage? Me, of all people. I have no gift for magic. Huh? But you... <sighs> I think you've been here long enough. No one asked you to come. Now leave me alone. Go! There's something iffy about that lad, I reckon. Do you think? No doubt. He's broken-hearted. But which piece of his heart is missing? What that boy's lost is his belief, like. Sure as eggs is eggs. His belief? That's right. Folks can tell him how blinking handsome he is till they're blue in the face, but will he believe him? Not a bit of it. Lost his belief he has in himself and everyone else. 
and he calls himself a prince. <laughs> That's a laugh. He's just a snivelling little wimp. Come on, let's go find that piece of heart. Right. Ugh. He's more trouble than he's worth. I guess we'll be going then, Your Highness. I know that man. But from where? Foreshadowing. Yeah, I, I know this part of the of the story. But um <clears throat> Yeah, pretty much after Hamlin I don't really have a clue. Misty? Oh. What's going on? Who in blazes do you think you are? And where in the world Who do are you, you spring from? I will have answers. Huh? We could ask you the same thing. Mind your tongue, girl. You stand before an emperor. We'll take care of them, your majesty. <laughs> stand down! I must discover how they came to appear here. And I shall not rest until I have done so. It is my sworn duty to know all that goes on in my domain. Come! Bring right them to my chamber. We have much to discuss. So. Uh, huh? <gasps> Lies. What are you talking about? And who are you? I mean, I thought the Emperor was the guy we just talked to. You know, the sniveling guy who was saying he's ugly. Wow, you sh seem to know a lot about this place, Swain. Now. Hmm. <laughs> it's because it is, damn it. Guess cone. Why is Swain going off on this guy? <laughs> Obviously Swain knows something about the uh, the Emperor here. Else he wouldn't be talking all this smack. Silence. 
Okay, well, I guess we're going to be going to find the kids. So, where do we find them? I guess we'll just follow the star. But yeah, since we're in the past, we don't know how we're in the past, but we're in the past. Uh, let's explore Hamlet. Yeah, that's kind of odd, right? I mean, how do we just, poof, end up in the past? Hopefully it gets explained later. Well, I think it does get explained later, but I'm not sure when. Hello, guards. I've heard some truly spine-chilling tales of ghosts in the valley to the north of here. It's lucky I don't believe in ghosts, eh? Yeah, it probably is. Horses. It's not always about brawn. No, I don't. Snuffle truffle challenge. Whatever. Whatever. Pig trotter shoes. I didn't say pig trotter shoes. Yeah, I figured I'd uh, walk around and talk to the uh, villagers of Hamelin here in the past because why not? You could totally skip talking to these people though. Magic and machinery. A piglet tank. What is it with freaking Hamlin and pigs? If only. Oh, I thought that guy was going to sell me armor. <laughs> He's like, why don't you take a look at my armor? And I was like, okay. Fruit juices. Mmm. Yeah, pretty much no, none of the people in town have anything in interesting to say, really. But, eh. I'll just show it off. Huh? Yeah, working on a pig tank would be kind of boring, I would think. Yeah, 
Well, anyways, I'm going to end the episode right here. That's all for this episode of Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. In the next episode, we'll continue exploring Hamlin in the past, and we'll try and tr find the two princes. This is Veteran 0121. I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.